Right, this is a question from Rachel. I would be interested in learning more about how we can best help our patients as they undergo IVF. In addition to the five element treatment protocols you outline in your handbook, are there any particular points that are helpful? And is there anything we can consider to help support the patient practitioner relationship during the time of stress for the patient? It's a good question that. First of all, I'm assuming you've done the most obvious points, which is cleared any CVGV block, which might be hindering conception. So we're assuming that's done and that you're doing good five element treatment on one element, which you assume is the patient's element. So that's all I would like to suggest in terms of points. Um, what is important, though, is that you, you as a practitioner have to work out how you deal with disappointment if the patient doesn't conceive. One of the real problems in, with dealing with this, with, with patients who can't conceive, is the practitioner's own disappointment. And that comes across to the patient. You have to tell the patient that you can't alter what nature's laid down for them. You can do the best you can, but it's in nature's hands what you do. So apart from supporting the element that you've chosen and supporting the patient through not being thrown if they, if they can't conceive, not being disappointed, not being upset, not showing that, that, apart from that, just be there for the patient because some patients find it very difficult coping with IVF and other patients are very good with that. So just support the patient in the way that you, you know how to do it.